Hello everyone and welcome back to the Washington Redskins franchise here on Madden 18. It is time for the Super Bowl. We are taking on the New England Patriots and Tom Brady and Bill Belichick and Tom Brady actually looking to become the winningest player ever with this sixth Super Bowl title if he would win this game. Charles Haley uh, has five, he has five, so looking to be the only player of all time in NFL history to become a player with six Super Bowls. As you see, he, you can see the journey the Patriots have uh, got there here this far, uh, beating the Bengals in the divisional round and then the uh, championship round, beating the Oakland Raiders. So now facing us here in the Super Bowl, and here we go, Super Bowl 53. So you have a team in New England that just continuously does it year after year. Tom Brady's still around now, sitting, I believe, at age... Uh, 42 so this may be his last game looking for Super Bowl title number six probably the greatest quarterback of all time and Bill Belichick looking for another title as he's probably the greatest coach and here comes the Washington Redskins a team that hasn't been in this spot in the Super Bowl since the Joe Gibbs led Redskins teams in the late 80s early 90s so we have where this this franchise is in a place where not they're not used to and haven't been in a long time. The Patriots are in a spot where they have been before, obviously just winning it last year. They were not in the Super Bowl, but the year before that, obviously making that amazing comeback against the Atlanta Falcons in the second half. So uh, we are in for a test here, obviously with Tom Brady and that offense. Just an unbelievable year, 49 touchdowns. Only, I believe, eight interceptions, winning the MVP in the NFL. And we have uh, our young quarterback, Nathan Peterman, so it's a little bit opposite there with him only really in his first year of starting. We have a, solid, a decent defense, a really nice run game. Um, our secondary is our strength, so hopefully we can shut down Brady, uh, shut down their run game. They do have a lot of solid running uh, backs. Obviously, Deion Lewis leading the way there. Uh, James White there as well. So this should be obviously a tough test facing a quarterback like this and a team like this. And obviously with the coach of Bill Belichick, he knows where to put his guys. So here we go. Brandon Cooks is back. Zane Gonzalez about to kick this one off. And we will get underway here with Super Bowl 53. And this one's going to be in the middle of the end zone. Cooks is just going to kneel this down. And they will take the ball first at the 25 yard line so here he comes MVP of the league Tom Brady five times Super Bowl champion you see 49 touchdowns only eight interceptions over 5,000 yards probably I would say the best year of his career even though he had those uh, record-breaking years with Randy Moss and company and on the first play he's gonna find Dwayne Allen and he is gonna be down to the 47 so just like that gain of 20 for this Patriots team and a first down so from the 47, Brady lining up single back is Deion Lewis. He is looking, has some time in the pocket, and he's going to find, that is Rob Gronkowski underneath open. Jay's ear in coverage. That was a pretty nice pass by Brady. Just getting it past Jay's ear. So going to his tight ends for the first down there. Single back, once again, is Deion Lewis. He's going to cut it back, taking down by Ryan Anderson there just for about a few yard gain. And we'll take a look at this New England Patriots offense. Obviously super productive. Guys all over the place, obviously up front. Really important protecting, obviously Tom Brady, Deion Lewis, 15 rush touchdowns, nine reception touchdowns on the year. Edelman, Gronk, so this team definitely has guys all over the place. So on third and nine from the 25, Brady looking, has some time to throw, only a four man rush. He can't find anybody, good coverage. And finally, Ryan Kerrigan is there for the sack to take him back to the 37. So there will be a field goal attempt here for New England. Steven Gaskowski from about 54 yards out, and this is up, and it is good. So New England will get on the board first here in the Super Bowl and take a 3-0 lead. So we will take the ball. Nathan Peterman and company, 26 touchdowns, 17 interceptions on the season. Not a uh, too bad a uh, first season for this young quarterback and obviously in the Super Bowl. So here we go, second and 10 from the 32. Peterman dropping back, looking, and he's gonna have a nice touch pass. That's gonna be to Emmanuel Sanders and he will be down to the 43 gain of 25. So they start out with a 28 yard gain. We start out with a 25. First and 10 now from the 43. Peterman looking, going up top and that's gonna be just a little overthrown. 
intended for Malcolm Mitchell there. And actually, what we're going to do is take a look at the uh, New England defense. This defense definitely underrated. Trey Flowers, outstanding, 17 sacks on the season. He is a monster. Dante Hightower, outstanding linebacker, can do everything all over the place. And Malcolm Butler, obviously, remember that pick against Seattle in the Super Bowl to clinch that one for New England a few years ago. So now third and five from the 38. Peterman's going to find the receiver there, Emmanuel Sanders, and he is just going to be a couple inches short. And instead of going for it, we're going to try a field goal attempt here to tie this one up, and Zane Gonzalez will hit it right down the middle, and we are tied up at three. So two drives, two field goals, 3-3 three, three game here in the first quarter. So New England back with the ball from the 25. They're going to go to Deion Lewis, and Lewis has got a hole, takes it to the outside, finally brought down there by Josh Norman to the 37, but give New England a first down. So single back once again is Deion Lewis. And they're going to go right back to him on a counter play. He's got some room to run. Makes a nice spin move. And he's off to the races. Deion Lewis with that speed. Finally, Josh Norman. No, he's going to break away from Norman. And finally, it looks like Shazier brings him down to Monte Nicholson. But a huge game for Lewis. And they're down to the 14. So New England offense moving the ball here in this, these first two drives. So this time, they're going to bring in James White. Tries a little bit of a move. Not sure what that was. Ryan Anderson takes care of business there. And that's going to be a loss of five. Nice job by the defense on that one. So third and 16, we're going to bring the heat on Brady, but it's not going to work. He has got very good protection. Looking in the back of the end zone, got to find Julian Edelman in the end zone for the score. But there is a flag on the play, so we'll have to see what this, if this is going to stand. And actually, it's going to be a legal touching on Edelman. You'll see here, he just steps out of bounds right there. And obviously, uh, can't be the first person to touch the ball, so that does not count. New England gets another field goal, 6-3 to three to score here in the first quarter. So we're going to get the run, try to get this running game going with Samaje Piran. Doesn't get much there, only a few yards, only seven yards on three carries so far in this game. Third and two, we're just going to go right back to Piran to try to get the running game going, and it doesn't work. He is stuffed, so we are going to have to punt the ball to New England. Nice job by their defense getting that stop. So 2.17 left in this first quarter. Deion Lewis with the carry. Tim Williams can't come up with them, and he has all day to run there. Huge hole. Finally brought down by Swearinger and Kerrigan, and he has a huge game now. Six carries for 80 yards. You see James White in there replacing and injured Deion Lewis, but he would return, and obviously there's a sack there by Monte Nicholson coming from the safety spot, knocking back New England on a third down, and we force a punt and get our offense the ball back. So just last play here, probably before the end of the first quarter. Peterman on the play action. He is looking, and he's going to find a wide open Josh Dotson there up to the 31-yard line. Gain of 18 for the first down, and that will be the end of this first quarter as we have a 6-3 to game here in the Super Bowl. Low scoring to begin with, but obviously with these two offenses, the way they are kind of moving the ball, I probably expect this game to be a little bit higher scoring. So here we go, second and seven in the second quarter. Peterman, watch out, and he is taken down. Jones there with the sack, knocking it back to the 27. So make this a third and 14. So we're going to go five wide. Peterman looking more pressure, and he is brought down. Harmon there for the sack, coming off the nickel, and we have to punt the ball. So New England's defense stepping up there. Not allow anything, and just like that, the running game for New England back at it with White with a great carry there up to the 38. Something I did not expect here so far is New England's running game, really the strength. So second and five, Brady is going to find Brandon Cooks up to the 17 for the first down. Perfect start for Brady, four for four for 68 yards. Really hasn't needed to do much with this run game. So now third and six, we're going to bring some heat, but they're going to have a screen on. It might work perfectly. Deion Lewis, but a nice tackle there by DJ Swearinger, not allowing him to get loose. And they will be stopped at the 13. So another field goal here for New England as they have a 9-3 lead now. So back on the offense, Frederick Candy with the carry, has a huge hole blocking, brought down there by Harmon at the 45. But that's what we need. We need to get this run game going. It's been slow to start. Help out Peterman in this passing offense. So first and ten back to Samashe Piran. And Dante Hightower is there for the stop. Loss of two on the play. 
So third and 12 from the 42. Peterman looking up the seam is Josh Johnson, and he's got some room to run. I don't think anybody's going to catch him, and he is in for the score. Touchdown, Redskins, 58 yards. First touchdown of the Super Bowl. Nice job finding him up the seam, splitting that zone, and good protection. And we will strike with the first touchdown of the game and now take the lead. 10 to 9. Nice job by Dotson there. Making the adjustment, turning around, and nobody's going to be able to catch him. So there we go. Finally getting this offense going as we take the 10 to 9 lead here in the second quarter. So New England will start their drive at the 25. First and 10. Brady looking. Play action. He's going to go deep and try to strike right back right away. And it's knocked away and complete. Nice play, play there by Swearinger to knock that one away. So now he has second and 10 for New England. About six minutes left in this first half. He's going to find Gronk. Brought down by Shazier. Just a tad short of the first down. So a third and short here for New England. They're just going to go I form Deion Lewis in the backfield. And actually going to play action. And Brady is brought down the sack. Tim Williams there. This time to bring him down. Force a punt. Nice job defense. Not falling for that play action there. So from the 17, let's see if we can get another score here before halftime. And Willie Young is in there to bring down Peterman for the sack. Knock us back to the 8-yard line. Now in a second and 19, Peterman looking, rolling out, trying to find somebody. And he's going to throw a dangerous pass, but it is caught perfectly there in between three defenders for the first down. So now first and 10, Samaji Piron's going to break a tackle. Gain of seven up to the 46-yard line. Still slow start, seven carries 15 yards. On a third and four, we're going to go out to the flat to Frederick Gandy, and he picks up the first down. So now up to the 43-yard line. Peterman looking outstanding here in this game so far. So first and 10, back to Piron. Finally has a big-time hole, and he is brought down at the 25. Nice job. So getting closer here, definitely in field goal range. It would be, nice. it would be a really good to see a touchdown here before halftime to take a bigger lead. So second and three, back to Piron. Cuts it through there. Has a first down and more. Breaks through a tackle, and he's going to be down to the three. Gain of 15. So make this first and goal now with just about a minute left in this first half. So first and goal handoff to Samaje Piron. He is just going through the lane there, and he is in for the score. So there you go. What a drive there by our offense. Going all the way, starting uh, after that sack from the 8-yard line, getting the score. And now have a 17-9 lead here with 40 seconds left in the first half. And Brady in this Patriots offense, not going to go quietly, finds the first down there up to the 42. We still have two timeouts now, second and eight. Brady looking, looking, can't find anybody. Just keeps dropping back. Nobody's get to him, and he's going to finally try to find that is going to be Gronk, but is knocked away there. Incomplete Cam Sutton there with the stop. So third and eight now from the 42. Brady is going to find Gronk on the outside for the completion brought down there by Norman, and they'll call a timeout. So they have one timeout left here with 21 seconds, and that's Bronson Kafusi up the middle for the sack. Patriots are going to have to use their last timeout. So 16 seconds, if we could just stop him in the middle of the field, I think that would be halftime. Brady's going to find Edelman, and they're going to run the clock here. So just eight seconds left, seven. The Patriots celebrating. Somehow they get the field goal team on. I'm not sure how that happened, but they get the field goal by Guskowski up and good and make this a 17-12 game here at halftime. So the Patriots have yet to reach the end zone where we have two scores of our own. I'm not really sure what happened there and allowed them to get that field goal team on. But the, the scene just cut, and then they just picked the play instantaneously, got that field goal team on, and got that field goal away. So in the second half, we're definitely going to have to stop the run game because that has been the problem for us so far. So here we go in the second half. Who's going to be the Super Bowl champion on second and 10 from the 34. Trey Flowers is there to bring down Nathan Peterman for the sack, knocking us back to so a third and 20. Not much you can really do here. Peterman looking, pressure in his face, just going to kind of throw this one in the dirt, throw it away incomplete, and New England forces a punt right away, and we'll get the ball back. So 
punt by Tress Way. See if we can angle this one out of bounds. And that's going to be Brandon Cooks with the catch. And he's got it. Makes the spin move. No, he's knocked away the ball. It's loose and we recover. So the first turnover of the Super Bowl comes on special teams. And we take the ball over at the 36-yard line. So first and 10 from the 36. Play action to Ganny Peterman rolling out. Looking, trying to find somebody. And he's going to have a great pass there to Emmanuel Sanders. And he comes down with a diving catch for the first down to the 15-yard line. So now first and 10 from the 15. Can we take advantage of this turnover? Peterman going underneath. That's going to be Dotson. Just a few yards there. Gain of six to the nine-yard line. Make it second and five. So we can still get a first before we have goal to go. Third and seven now. Peterman looking. He's going to find that Sanders. He's in for the score. Touchdown. So we take advantage of the fumble by Brandon Cooks, get the score, and now take a 24-12 lead here in the third quarter. So now the Patriots in a kind of familiar position like the last Super Bowl they were in against the Falcons down. Patrick Owanso there with a great stop in the backfield, knocking Daniel Lewis to the 22. So third and 13 now. Brady looking. He's going to find Dwayne Allen, and it's a missed tackle there by Sutton. He had him kind of dead to rights there. All I got to do is kind of take out his legs, misses him, and then Dwayne Allen gets away. So that's a big first down for New England. As you see, just couldn't get him. Heads up to the sideline, picks up the first, and extends the drive here for New England. So first and 10 from the 44, and up to Deion Lewis. Missed tackle there by Shazier. Makes the spin move, a juke move there on Swearinger, and he's off to the races. Deion Lewis is not going to be caught, and just like that, New England gets their first touchdown of the game. 56-yard run there by Deion Lewis. Missed tackle by Shazier. Juked out here. Look at the juke on Swearinger as he just doesn't get anything on him there. And Deion Lewis with his speed cannot be caught. So New England right back in it here with the score. 24 to 19, eight minutes left here in the third quarter. So on second and nine with our offense, we're gonna do a little screen there to Josh Dotson. Not gonna really work out. Doesn't really pick up anything. No gain, just getting back to the line of scrimmage. So third and nine, Peterman going to find Jordan Reed, but he cannot hang on to the ball. Dante Hightower with a fantastic hit. And we have to punt it away. So New England with the bat ball back on a second and four. Going to find Brandon Cooks. So that'll make it up third and one. Looks like a run here for sure. No, it's going to be a play action. Brady rolls out and he's going to find his receiver. And that is caught on the sideline. Great pass. Great catch up to the 49-yard line for the first down. So on a second and two, Brady, another play action to Deion Lewis. He is looking for somebody, just going to go underneath, going to find Devlin, the fullback. He breaks a tackle and got, finally brought down at the 33, and he picks up the first down. So it looks like Brady in this offense starting to get into a rhythm. That is not what you want to see. First and 10, Brady looking. He's going to find Edelman for the first down up to the 22-yard line, gain of 11. So 340 left in this third quarter. Second and three. Brady has all day to throw. He's going to find Dwayne Allen who gets a block from Edelman. And he's in for the score. So Dwayne Allen on the last drive picking up that huge first down. This time picking up the touchdown. So New England for the two point. And they are going to get it to Brandon Cooks. And now have a three point lead just like that. They were down 12. And now have a three point lead in about an instant. So we find ourselves down here in the Super Bowl in the third quarter. Nice run there by Samaj P. Run finally picking it up after a very slow start. So first to 10 from the 50. Peterman looking. And what a throw kind of off his back foot. Going to find Malcolm Mitchell all the way across the other end of the field for 24 yards up to the 26-yard line. So second and two, Peterman hands off to Piron. Has a huge hole, runs over the safety, down to the six, gain of 12, and all of a sudden this game has kind of turned into a shootout, it seems like. Second and goal, Peterman looking. Gonna find Malcolm Mitchell, and he's gonna be just a tad short. And that will bring us to the end of the third quarter. So this Super Bowl looks like uh, a really, really good one. Going into the fourth quarter, down three. Can we ha can we come back here, get the victory, and give ourselves a Super Bowl victory here in year number two? So hand off to Zamaji Piron on third and goal, and he is stuffed, going nowhere. 
So we are just gonna kick the field goal, tie this game up to, at 27. So here we go, 12.50 left in this final quarter. Hand off to Deion Lewis, and he has a huge hole up the middle. Gain of 12 up to the 41, has 165 yards on the ground. He is absolutely dominating this, and same with this uh, offensive line of New England. So second and 10, finally there. Jonathan Allen with a good stop, bringing him down for no gain. Third and 10 from the 41, we're gonna bring up Blitz. But it's picked up, Brady looking, trying to find somebody, just gonna throw this one away and we get a stop. Nice job there by our defense. And we get the ball back. So third and three now, hand off to Piron. Nice blocking by our offensive line, taking out everybody there for the first down easily up to the 37. Piron almost at 100 yards. Second and 10, setting up the screen to Frederick Gandy. Tries to make a move and a nice tackle there by Harmon at the 46, keeping us a yard short. So we couldn't get third and goal from the one, but this time on third and one, we are gonna pick up the first down and keep it going here up to the 49 yard line. So now a third and eight, Peterman looking, looking, he's gonna go underneath and find Dotson there for the first down. Nice job, gain of 14. So just 640 left in this ball game. First and 10, hand off to Piron, has a huge hole, nice block, and he's gonna be down to the 24. See if they give us the first, no. It's gonna be second and inches, but now over 100 yards rushing for Piron. Second and inches, our offensive line just mowing down everybody. Picks up the first down to the 22. So we're wasting a lot of clock here. Need a touchdown on the field goal, obviously, with Brady on the other side. And second and 10 going up top is Bucky Hodges, and he comes down with it. So give us first and goal from the two. His first catch of this game couldn't have come at a better time. Gain of 20. So here we go, first and goal from the two-yard line. We're going to hand off to Piron, and he is stopped short there. Nice tackle there with a the defensive tackle. So now bring up a second and goal. Piron still in the backfield. We're going to go a play action. Peterman tries to find Jordan Reed. Had to get rid of that one a little too quick. Incomplete. So bring up third and goal. Now going to spread everybody out. Peterman looking. He's going to find Josh Dotson for the touchdown. So with 335 left in this ball game, we have taken the lead 34 to 27. What a drive by this Redskins offense. Over 15 plays. We said about six minutes off the clock. And here we go. Tom Brady coming on the field. He's been in these situations before. And he has definitely uh, made great good, good of them. So here we go. First and 10. He's going to find Julian Edelman wide open. Not sure what Norman was doing there. Got beat severely there. So 26 yards up to the 49. So first and 10, 254 left in this ball game. Brady going back to Edelman. He's got another catch up to the 35. Gain of 14 to so this New England offense. Moving the ball here. Need a touchdown to tie. First and 10. Brady has time to throw. Going to find Brandon Cooks. And the ball is loose. Knocked away there by a one star. And we recover. Unbelievable. Brandon Cooks with his second fumble of this football game. And the second one comes at a terrible time as they were moving the ball. It was checked at. It was a catch. He didn't make the football move. Knocked away. This one will stand. So we have 2 way weight left. If we get a couple first downs, we can end this game. But that's not going to help out our chances there. Loss of two. So two-minute warning. Two minutes left in this ball game. New England still has all their timeouts. So we're going to have to at least get maybe one to two first downs to end this ball game. But here we go. This should be a good one. Can we get a first down or not? So second and 12 now, coming back from the two minutes. Piron as a whole, and he's gonna be brought down at the 25. New England uses their first timeout. So here we go, third and eight. Can we get the first down? Peterman looking, he can't find anybody, but he runs out of time anyway. Sacked by New England, they call the timeout. And here we go, Tom Brady has a minute and 43 with one timeout. Brady looking, trying for Gronk, and he can't hang on to it. That would have been a huge play, but kind of knocked away by Swearinger, so nothing there incomplete. Second and 10, Brady finding Brandon Cooks, and he's got the first down, crossed the 50-yard line to the 48-yard line, and they're going to hurry it up now. 122 left in the game. Brady 
looking. Has some time to throw. No pressure. See a couple guys get knocked down. Going up top, and it's knocked away by Josh Norman. Nice job trying to find Chris Hogan there. So third and six now for New England. Brady looking, and he's got the cross the middle. That's Julian Edelman open for the first down to the 23-yard line. 44 seconds left in this ball game. Second and 10. Brady looking. Going to go underneath. It's going to be Deion Lewis, and they're going to say he got out of bounds. So from the 10-yard line, here we go. First and 10. From the 10, 38 seconds. We're going to bring some heat. Try to get Brady off that spot there. It doesn't work. He's looking. He's going to dump this one off to Dwayne Allen. That's going to be at the 5. Does not get out of bounds, so they're going to have to hurry it up now. Let's see if they're just going to spike this one. Brady's going to line it up. That's exactly what they're going to do. And Brady is going to... Actually, there's going to be a full start. Unbelievable. So with that, it's a 10-second runoff. Now there's only 9 seconds left. Brady going to find Edelman. And the timeout by New England. So here we go. Third and seven. Six seconds left in the Super Bowl. And they need a touchdown. Brady to Gronk. And he's got it. Rob Gronkowski with the touchdown. Unbelievable. With just two seconds left in this ball game, the Patriots have gone down the field and they've done it. They've just about tied this one up. Gronk. In the back of the end zone, getting the feet down. And now here comes the all-important extra point against Guskowski's extra point is up. It is good. And we are tied at 34. And we go to overtime. Unbelievable. What a what a game here. Uh, the Patriots taking that lead. We come back at the lead, and they come right back with just seconds remaining to get the lead. So here we go in overtime. The coin toss, we will re win it. We will receive. So obviously we get that touchdown on the first drive. We win the ball game. A field goal, the game extends, obviously. And if New England gets a field goal, it just goes to, you know, next score wins pretty much. But here we go. Second and five. And trying to find Dotson, the receiver, but it's knocked away from by Malcolm Butler there. So now third and five from the 33. Peter and Blitz coming. Going to find Emmanuel Sanders for the first down to the 41-yard line. So move those chains. First and 10. We're going to play action to Samaji Piron. Peterman looking, going up top, and it's going to be intercepted. He tried to kind of back shoulder throw uh, to Malcolm Mitchell. The corner wasn't looking. Just turned around just in time. You'll see corner's not really looking. And kind of underthrown, he turns around, picks this one off. So now New England, all they need is a field goal, and they will win this game. So second and 11 from the 36. Brady looking, and this one's going to be intercepted. Tim Williams with the pick, drop back in the zone, and he's going to be brought down at the 47-yard line. What a mistake by Brady. Did not see Tim Williams dropping back there in the zone blitz. So now all we need is a field goal to win, and we're very close to field goal range. First and 10, hand off to Piron, and he's not going to get anything there. Only about a gain of two up to the 45. Third and eight now. Peterman looking, can't find anybody, and he's going to be sacked. Back to the 44, so we cannot take advantage of that interception, and we're going to have to punt the ball back to New England. So here's Brady, second and nine, going to find Gronk, and he's going to be attached short of the first down to the 27-yard line, third and inches. Can we get a stop? And New England with another false start. So that's going to drop them back there to the 22-yard line, making this about a third and seven. So here we go. Brady in this offense from the 22, third and five. Dropping back to pass. He is looking. He's going to find a wide open receiver, Chris Hogan. Just running down the seam easily. First down to the 47. So first and 10 now. Brady going to hand this one to Deion Lewis. And he's up the middle. Huge hole. Picks up another first down to the 42. And they are just about a field goal range for Steven Guskowski, who had had... Um, at about a 54-yarder earlier. And Deion Lewis, another huge hole. Our defense falling apart here at the end. Up to the 29. And they are in field goal range easily now. So second and four. They're going to go to James White. And he's got some room to the outside. Finally brought down there by Awanso and Tim Williams. But picks up another first down. And here we go. New England 
trying to win this Super Bowl with this field goal. A 32-yard attempt. Guskowski, we call the timeout to freeze him, and it's not going to matter as he makes the field goal, and the New England Patriots have come back and won this Super Bowl 37-34. Unbelievable game here in Super Bowl 53. I thought we had it when we got a couple times in this game when we got the uh, turnover there by Brandon Cooks. We couldn't take advantage, and obviously the pick there by Tim Williams in overtime couldn't do anything with that. And the New England Patriots have done it once again. Tom Brady winning his sixth Super Bowl. Unbelievable, this team. This franchise is just outstanding. Not much you can really say about it. As we come to the Super Bowl here in our second season of this franchise, coming up short against the uh, pretty much the greatest quarterback and greatest coach of all time. So that's still a great season, but very disappointed. We could not get it done. I thought we had it multiple times, and it didn't happen. The Patriots just made the plays at the end of the game to make sure they were Super Bowl champions. See, Hightower had a great game. Tom Brady was un. Believable, unstoppable, and we lose 37 to 34. See, Nathan Peterman had a pretty good game. Samaji Piran actually had a pretty good game too, over 100 yards in the touchdown. Emmanuel Sanders, good game. Uh, Dotson with the two two scores on himself. So our offense. See, Jordan Reed really has been a disappointment the last, I would say, half of the season. Hasn't really done a whole lot. Um, really, our offense did as about as good as job he can. Not coming up with key first downs though and moving the ball when we needed it. But Tom Brady and the uh, New England offense, look at it, th 376, had the one mistake, two touchdowns. But really, Deion Lewis just took over this game, 189 yards, had that huge touchdown. We could not stop him. Even James White had it, was averaging eight yards a carry there. And then Edelman with over 100 yards, Gronk with the, the touchdown there at the end, and Dwayne Allen with the big touchdown. So... Their offense was very unstoppable, tough for our defense. We really couldn't get any pressure on Brady. He was allowed to just sit back there, do whatever he wants, and Deion Lewis was just killing us. So really unbelievable game, and we lose the Super Bowl. So that means we're going to head in the offseason, have to make uh, some adjustments. Um, not really sure what to do yet. Uh, so going forward, I'd have to say we have a quarterback in place, obviously, other than last year with Peterman. have a run game. A lot of our receiver contracts are up, so that's going to be interesting to see um, what we're going to do there. Offensive line should be good. Uh, defense might need a little bit of work, obviously, with that last game. But really in the playoffs, our defense was outstanding, so I'm not sure what I want to do. Maybe it was just a uh, – obviously Tom Brady, just tough to stop. So that is going to do it and be the – Conclusion there of season number two. Obviously last year uh, didn't even make the playoffs. This year we get to the Super Bowl, come up short. So maybe next year we can get back to the Super Bowl and uh, actually win in season number three. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for everybody, all the support. I really appreciate it. It's really crazy how many people love this, and I'm just so surprised. So thank you once again, and we will see you in the next one in the offseason. So have a good one. Bye-bye.